What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back. Guys, how we doing today? Another vid, another market vid. 100K in the comments for a chance at winning 10K. I mean, anything in the comments. I prefer questions in the comments, but anything in the comments. Let's get this vid to 100 likes. Someone will win 10K stubs. Guys, I just want to go over the market. The market is slowly increasing. Not really. Um, Bill Mazeroski actually went up 6k, right, looking off of it from yesterday, it was 14k on my stream, um, he was actually 13k on my stream, but anyways, guys, the market is rising, um, hopefully MLB doesn't want to drop anything new, um, it's time to start buying, guys, and we're gonna go over a bunch of players that you should buy that I think are gonna go up, and I think I have a lot of value, so anyways, let's get into it. I just want to make sure that SDS didn't do his dirty and draw more packs. Let's see. Um, we popped both of them. If you haven't checked out the packs I popped, you should go check them out. Um, listen, I'm broke right now. Um, if you guys don't want to believe that I don't I have stubs, I don't know what to tell you. Um, Justin Upton Braun. Justin Upton and Braun are right there, 100 k I have four Chris Bryants. I have so many duplicates. I wish I could... You know, I'm just going to show you my inventory. Um, just because... Um, people want to take advice from people with stubs, so I just want to show you what I'm doing right now. Um, I'm going to show you all the players I invested in, um, and you guys should follow my investments. So, real quick, alright, so we invested in some Severinos, we invested in some Blake Snells. Um, I just want to show you, I have a lot of duplicates. So, ready, Jose Bro, I invested in 11 Abreu's, I invested in 3 Yones, or whatever his name is. I invested in Carrasco, I invested 25 in Trevor Bowers. Three Carlos Santanas. I invested in. There's a lot. 16 with Merrifields. Two Alberts, uh, or not even Albert. Don't have. Don't even. I don't know how to say his name. I have 17 Jose Barreos, the ace of the Twins. Literally one of the top pitchers in the league. Otani's five. We got Chapman. I have 11 Chapmans. I invested him at gold. So as you can see, all these things I'm showing you, bro. I promise you that I am not broke in this game. I have three Springers. I have 13 Okunas. Uh, these are all perfect investments. These are all the players I invested in. Um, no investments here. We have two Edwin Diaz. I actually didn't even know. I have 10 Pete Alonzos. Hopefully, he goes diving this year. Um, we got four Chris Bryan, seven Rizzos, seven Kimbrels, um, four Luis Castillos, um, one Josh Bell, two Starling Marte. Starling Marte is actually doing really good. I'm about to buy one more. He's doing really freaking good right now. He's super underrated. One of the most underrated outfielders in the league. We got Ozuna. We got Andrew Miller. We got two Kenson Marte. Should be more. Zach Granke. We got six. We got, who is that? Five of Luke Weavers. Dude, Luke Weaver was doing so good. And he's like out for season. 22 stories. 18 Blackmans. Right there, that's 40K. Wait, no. That's way more than 40K. That's 20K for him. He's like 3K. Two times three. Dude, that's a lot of stubs, man. We have so many stubs. Literally just an investment. So if you guys think I'm broke, uh-uh. We got two Machado, seven Yates. It just keeps going. But anyways, guys, let's get into the video. I'm going to show you guys who we should uh, get. All those investments were made probably this week. Um, Especially Machado's and Chris Bryant's. Dude, they're so cheap. I'm going to show you some live cards to invest in. Just because they're in collections, they have value right away. Um, People are asking how to make stubs right now. To be honest, the only way to make stubs right now... Is looking at price gaps and um, you just want to check who's really cheap. So right now, bro, JD Martinez is still <clears throat> an 85 overall. He's still a top player right now. Um, he's hitting so good. He literally could go up to 100 power. He's doing so good still. Um, 13k for 85 Martinez, bro. Not only is he a good card to have on your team, he's just a beast overall. He could play a pitch hitter. He could do anything. And the only thing is his defense. Honestly, I see him as a pitch hitter. Um, his vision's a little low, but yo, this guy hits ding-dongs all the time. Very good investment at 13k. Um, Okuna, bro, 5k for Okuna, bro. Everyone knows how this dude plays. He's a freaking tank. When he's hot, he's hot. When he's hot, nobody touches him. When he's hot, he drops a two-homer game, a homer game with two, two singles, three singles, stolen bases. He is just a fantasy god. He is a beast god. He's just my one of my favorite players. So young, too. Um... Next up, Chris Bryant at 13K. Listen, this guy actually plays so freaking well for me. I highly recommend you literally get him and use him. My team is stacked and I still play him. He's so freaking good. I highly recommend him. He's all around a beast. He had so many dingers for me. 
I recommend. Um, 13k for Chris Bryant is a snag. Um, let's see. Edwin Diaz, 15k is a snag. Aaron Judge, Kluber, no. Um, where's my Machado? Let's see. Jose Altuve at 14k is a snag. Um, Machado at 29k is a very good price. I got online for about 25. He would dig up a little bit, but you guys should definitely pick him up. Um, Kershaw, not bad, 16k. Christian Yelich is not bad, 60k. Christian Yelich is one of the best players in the league. At 60k, I honestly think that's a pretty good freaking price. Uh, let's go over some golds. Kimbrough at 1k is very good. Granky at 2k is good. Snell at 1, 1.9. He's just pitched a gem. I literally think he's going to get upgraded again. That's why I tried buying a lot, but I did not succeed. Um, Ryu at 2k is not bad. One of the best pitchers in the league. Xander at... Yeah, everyone thinks Xander's going to go diamond. I think he is too. And he got snubbed of an all-star. Actually, wait. Did he make the all-star game? I think he might have just made it. Um... 3k for Xander. Trey Turner, 1600 coins. That's a very, very good buy. Um, yeah, Charlie Morton's good. Story at 28 is not bad. If he goes down, make 2,000 stubs clean. Um, yeah, that's really all for the golds. And Trevor Bauer, yo. He's still quick sell value. He pitched a gem. Go pick him up, bro. Trevor Bauer literally has one of the most high strikeout, rate, strikeout rates in the game. He's so... Un Honestly, bro, he's one of the most underrated pitchers, in my opinion. Like, yeah, he gets lit up here and there, but he doesn't get lit up with earned runs and hits. He gets lit up with home runs. Home runs kind of bully him, but he has a lot of strikeouts, so I would go ahead and get him. DJ LeMayu, a top player in the game. Pete Alonso, a top player in the game right now. Whit Merrifield, a top player in the game. Go pick up all these players, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, you'll make stubs in the wrong run. Make stubs even now because the market is still rising because all those things that they drop. Anyways, let's go into like some 99 overalls that I think you should buy. Right now, bro. This Gary Carter is so filthy. And for 92k, I don't think you go wrong. If you have the stubs for him, I would buy him and, and hold him. He might go up to 120k. He's a 99 overall catcher. He's absolutely stacked. He's just so beautiful. He's so good. Um, we got Alkaline, not uh, not good. Price gap. Canley, not bad. Alright, listen. Billy Wagner at 54k. If you guys want to do the fourth inning collection. We got Wagner up here. We got George Brett. We got freaking Cal Ripken. Bro, Bill, uh, Andrew McCutcheon, 98, is disgusting. First of all, I want him on my team. Ryan Braun already went up 9K. He was 50K. Listen, there's a lot of cards that are going up slowly. You guys have to try to get your stubs together and try to go all in out and freaking buy these cards. If you want to buy stubs, listen, this is a good time to buy stubs. You can make double the stubs if you buy stubs. If you really want to buy stubs, I'm not buying stubs. Um... Andrew McCutcheon at 54k. If you want to do the fifth, fifth inning collection, you need to buy these players. Make sure you buy them now. You do not want to wait. You're not going to see them cheaper. If you see them cheaper, it's because they drop more packs. If they drop more packs, good night, Moon. I'm going to cry. It's going to ruin my day. Go ahead, pick up McCutcheon 50k. Kluber at 60k is not bad. Bro, Wade Boggs 98 is that cheap. I find that insanity. Um, realistically, I think his card is terrible. You know why? Because Keith Hernandez is 20k, and his stats are actually better. So, look at that. Ready? His speed's better. His reaction's better. His feeling's better. His contact is a little worse, but his power's better. His vision's very similar. He's 17K. Wade Boggs is 47. Right there. That's a crazy price guy. If you need a player, go pick up Keith Hernandez, 14K. He's a beast. Um, one player that caught my eye that was really freaking cheap and you guys should pick up is the Travis Hafner. Where is he? A 94 overall for what? 10K? The freaking 11K for a 94 overall. I mean, yeah, his fielding's so bad. If you need a freaking beast pitch hitter, probably a top freaking pitch hitter against both sides of the plate, go pick up Hafner. He's got the vision. He's got the power. He's a freaking monster. Completely slept on. Um, another player that I feel like you should pick up is Whitney Ford. He's out of packs. Um, where is he? Whitney Ford's at 93. I'm bugging. Oh, uh, where is he? Mazeroski at 13K. That's a big price cap. This is a very good price cap to make stubs. If you guys are watching this, go go ahead and buy this. A lot of people buy the Bill Mazeroski. I know a lot of people are obsessed with this card. Um, I would go ahead and buy him. He has 125 vision. He's amazing fielding. Pretty crappy power, but contacts there. Um, Whitney Four at 8K. Yo, listen. I actually might get him and just start him. He has a great, 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 great um, fastball slider, curveball sinker change. He has a great pitching. Um, what is it called? I don't even know. Um, but anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed, um, a lot of players that are really cheap. Andre Dawson for 12k is another one. 
If you guys are watching this, all these players are named, bro. When they go up in value, you're going to thank me. You're going to make a, a ton of stubs. If they drop a stub sale, we're all loaded. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Listen, we got another vid tomorrow. As per usual, we don't take days off. Maybe Sunday I'll take a day off. Maybe. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you enjoyed your fourth. Have a good one. Oh, oh.